Yeah, this box is definitely giving me version one vibes. About to see the world in action. What we can be live with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we waited for. cousin welcome or welcome back to my channel i am jess here on jess for tv where we are all about providing you with an assortment of high quality content for your entertainment pleasures as well as speaking your interests while still satisfying your needs and wants about everything that is lifestyle so today cousin i am back on your screen because your girl has finally received her second walmart trendsetter box i don't know what took so long i don't know if they were out of stock i don't know but i ordered my two trendsetter boxes at the same time when they came out back in december around the time that i received my winter quarter subscription box so i received that first subscription box which was version one of the trendsetter boxes and i did a video for that and I also did a video for the unboxing of my quarterly winter beauty box for 2021 so if you have not seen those videos make sure you go check those out they're pretty dope with what was inside of those boxes for the now $6.98 I believe is the cost of these subscription boxes it was five but now I think they added on some tax I don't know if the tax is for shipping or if the tax is for tax but it's some more tax on there it's like a dollar and some change so your box ends up being a little under seven dollars which is still not bad for the contents that come in this box so like I said I have finally received my second box that I paid for so this video is going to be about the unboxing of that box I do want to say that I kind of believe that this box is going to be similar to that first trendsetter box so this may end up being a quick fast and short and in a hurry unboxing video for this second trendsetter box for the winter edition for Walmart Beauty so without further ado let's just jump right into it and open this box up shall we so this is the box it definitely looks similar to that first trendsetter box but opening up this box of course you have your little content card with everything oh yeah oh yeah definitely definitely seen a lot of this stuff so yeah i have the biore charcoal pore strips for your nose and I definitely received this a time before. I don't know if it was in the last Trader Setter box, but I definitely already have this. So yeah. Next inside this box is this Vital Protein Beauty Collagen, the Lavender Lemon. Definitely received this last time. So yeah, I think we're just gonna move right on along here. Some fingernail polish. This is the Essie brand, just a different color. This is, this is in the color Spice It Up. So it's definitely the same brand, just a different color. Where is that color? So last time I just received this gold one and it's Essie. So yeah, this box is definitely giving me version one vibes, just different color, but oh well. Next. We have the same two Tresemme lightweight hydration shampoo and conditioner. That is the same. I definitely received, like literally, I literally have all this stuff sitting here from last time. I've actually used these, but yeah, it's definitely like a recycled, so to say, box, but I swear you can never have too many products and that is actually on me because I chose to purchase these boxes outside of the quarterly subscription for I think these boxes are like $10 and I chose to purchase both of them thinking that they would be different when they're actually kind of the same unless they made the mistake and sent me version one again I don't know but I mean I can definitely use the product so I'm not tripping so next inside of this box we have the elf restoring infused with rose hip oil this go around and if you guys watched my first unboxing for the trendsetter box i actually received this one the elf soothing facial mist so same brand but just different products within the line i guess so yeah well you can definitely never have enough facial oil restoring mist so yeah 
Next, I <laughs> I got some more NYX. Come through NYX, I'm with it, I'm with it. It's another filler. So it's another NYX filler. And this one, Bezos. Is this one, let me see if I can find the other one. Oh no, this is actually, it's the same color, everything, but, and I haven't even used this one yet. So now I have two of these. So that's like literally not different at all. Same with the Tresemme shampoo and conditioner. So I told y'all this is gonna be a quick video. It's like a whole imitation box, but whatever, I'm here for it. So, ah, you guys. Next I have the Bliss Rose Gold Rescue Gentle Foaming and Cleanser for Sensitive Skin. Definitely seen this before. Let me see if I can find the one that I got from my last box. Yep, there she blows. So yeah, I got another one of these. So yeah, this is, this is literally an invitation box. This is an invitation. It's a copycat box. It's a copycat box. This is exactly what it is, it's a copycat. And last but not least, I received the Exfoliating Dual Texture Scrubber, which I definitely already have from my last box. So, yeah, this is everything that was inside of the box. It's definitely a duplicate, a copycat, an imitation of basically everything that I received in the first Trendsetter box. I was hoping that by purchasing both of the Winter Trendsetter boxes that I would get, you know, something different. Get two boxes with a bunch of different products, but that wasn't the case. But I'm not mad at it. It's definitely not more so a hit. It's not a miss either, but it's not a hit either. This box is just okay simply because i've seen these products before i already have them got them in the last box so i do feel like i paid an additional ten dollars and waited on a box that i already basically had if that makes sense so yeah this was basically just an imitation box like i said just same brand different variation of product but yeah guys that is actually everything that was inside this box if you found this short unboxing interesting and or valuable or if you have since watching my last two videos purchased your walmart beauty box comment down below and let me know Tell me what you think about it. Tell me if you too will purchase an additional trendsetter box on top of the subscription box that you already pay for quarterly. I just want to know you guys' feelings on it because I'm kind of on the fence now if I really want to purchase these trendsetter boxes. Again, I will say that February Black History box came all the way through. Like as long as it's February, I will definitely be purchasing that additional trendsetter box. However, when it comes to the winter time, I think in October too, around Halloween, they also come out with two additional boxes in addition to quarterly subscription that you already pay for. However, I think going forward, I'm just going to purchase one version of that Trendsetter box without purchasing two because I definitely got the same products that I already had from that first box. But at any rate, I digress. Thank you guys so much for clicking to watch this video. If you haven't done so already, do me a quick favor and hit that subscribe button. This will count as your good deed for the day. If you've been here, done that, thank you so much, cousin. I appreciate your continued support. Your good deed is done and has not gone unnoticed. Lastly, make sure you turn on your post notifications so that you don't miss out on any entertainment or lifestyle content from me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Peace.